Yesterday's video, we showed 227 bucks in line with XRP, even though the United States Securities and Exchange Commission filed to appeal the Ripple lawsuit claiming that XRP became security. Became security. But nowadays we screen to you meant something even crazier, which is 227 is simplest, the very least amount that XRP could be priced because XRP is set to get its biggest, biggest, biggest purchase again in history by using the Federal Reserve showed by way of Fox News of $30,000 consistent with XRP buy buyback. Uh, yes, we're confirming it in ultra modern video as the United States of C formally appraised the XRP ETF filed by Bitwise and both Ripple and the SEC confirmed that they have officially entered into agreement discussions in an emergency meeting. This is all going to be revealed in today's epic video. So earlier than we get right into modern day video, we're going to be website hosting a huge XRP giveaway. Guys, we're getting simply near 30,000 subscribers and so we are approximately to do a huge giveaway for all of the XRP holders, providing you with men some greater XRP tokens. Uh, all you purchase to do to enter the giveaway is in reality tap the like button. Join the channel together with your put up notifications and proportion this video. Now, of course, with the entirety being stated, let's get right into the content. So first matters first, let's make it clear. Settlement among Ripple and the SEC showed nearly assured, nearly assured, because the United States Securities and Exchange Commission issues an emergency assembly to discuss the potential settlement decision rapidly after the XRP lawsuit attraction between Ripple and the SEC. But here's in which matters take a huge shift and we get into the buyback discussions of XRP. In a report showed by Google, which is thinking the fact with the intention to the federal government purchase lower back all the XRP. Its solutions through saying, yes, the Federal Reserve plans to take possession of Ripple XRP as a worldwide fee solution. Is Ripple buying back enjoy a part of their buyback application? Yes, Ripple is buying return experience a part of their buyback application to take it out of retail arms and into institutional fingers. And this virtually may be a reality, mainly while you look at the whole thing that has been taking place, which includes the reality that JP Morgan is ready to just accept XRP for credit card and loan bills. And same is going for Wells Fargo that's approved payments and XRP for credit plane claim cards and loans. Now, when we go return to the primary photograph, and this is 227 greenbacks per XRP, even as this is something that we have a look at on the quick time period time frame, and that we're going to hit in the very brief run, whilst we observe the huge scale and the extensive scale adoption, 30. Zero, zero, zero makes sense, especially when speaking approximately the capacity of getting the Federal Reserve buyback XRP alongside Ripple. In fact, the Fong's journal suggestions add to the investigation of the Federal Reserve buyback application pricing XRP at $30,000 and actually confirms that there is potential that it may show up. Because it is passed off similarly lower back inside the days with gold while the federal government decided to buy lower back gold, they offered it again at a preset charge, higher than what was predicted significantly. Another key pointer is the XRP ETF. I assume it is pretty clear now that the XRP ETF is essentially going to take place. It's been accepted by way of a couple of entities which include the United States Securities and Exchange Commission. Again, this showed a few matters. Number one, the XRP rate goes to mirror the huge increase. Number the wide scale adoption of XRP is coming now not only for on the retail aspect, now not only for on the retail aspect, now not only for retail, however, certainly for establishments. Because having an XRP ETF now allows establishments and big banks in addition to stock accept as true with price range with a view to genuinely buy XRP the use of the ETF. So on the adoption scale, we're speaking about a boom in that as well. And last but no longer least, the settlement is inevitable and goes to occur. Now, of root, that is the spotlight of an element of the video, and there's additives of this video. First agreement showed about XRP and 2D is the XRP buyback, probably at $30,000. Uh, so, as we verify those two reports that the SEC goes to basically come to be the lawsuit with the Ripple employer, deem XRP not a protection via agreement, and the buyback is in development with the aid of the Federal Reserve, showed via Fox News, via Fox News, via more than one different entities. Including even the SEC, while you are looking at them approving XRP ETFs, you recognize you will have a deliver shack, and you recognize companies like Bitwiser and those establishments which might be going to be buying into the XRP ETF properly. They may be going to want more XRP. And if Ripple would not have some, well, they're going to have to shop for it. So, I mean, the concept is you are getting XRP buybacks, so the ones are showed. But the opposite spotlight of this video is any other issue. And this is another a part of the XRP ledger. That's simply the CTF token. I need to talk a bit, bit about this because we have been getting numerous interest. The CTF token that is built to the XRP ledger and the Polygon chain, it is certainly considered one of the largest DeFi tokens on the XRP ledger and at the Polygon chain. But a number of people are questioning, is it a scam? Is it not a scam? And that is the clarification for anyone watching this video. The first element is over the last nine months since the launch of the CTF token. That is guys using my research. And again, I'm no longer monetary marketing consultant. Now I'm not economic consultant. I constantly do my research. 
but the CDN token skyrocketed over 33,000% in the closing nine months. On top of this, they have been capable of list on MEX, a prime centralized alternate, the simplest list trusted and dependable crypto toe tasks. So they were given indexed on MEX officially. They've introduced that they are going to be listing on Albank that's insane. Like right, right here it's reliable and this become actually just hours in the past. It's legitimate wherein it is stated to announce that your CDN reward tokens will be indexed on Albank Exchange. And once more, it did get showed by means of Albank because if you click on Albank right, right here and scroll all the way down, right, right here while you pull it up, it says new listing that they'll be listing the CTF token. So again, you obtain indexed on Max and on all bank important exchanges that they go through a completely thorough audit to verify that this is a tested legitimate entity. So obviously it's gotten the check mark for that. Um, pinnacle of that is depended on by using CoinMarketCap and Coing Echo, and also you men can confirm that in your very own. It's simply a software challenge. It's the first ever crypto cashback cutback loyalty machine program that ever exists with a blockchain built in producing passive income rewards framework. Man of the idea is 30 to 50 trading goes to flow into the CTF token and with best $40 billion market cap, it is confirmed that is assured that the CTF token will skyrocket over $1,400. So it may without problems do a huge surge of $1,400 due to the fact we're just speaking about the XGB ledger in that point. Now upload directly to that Polygon chain and upload directly to the institutional adoption that the CTF token will get and the crypto trading fund gets. Well, it confirms that $1,400 is actually dirt cheap right here. And sure, we are presently sitting at around 76 cents. However, it is all approximately the utility and the concept. Uh, now consider it like this CTF token is not even yet indexed on two decentralized exchanges, handiest indexed on one. And it is now not even crypto.com. It is now not Binance. It's MEX men. It is MEX men. Imagine it gets indexed on crypto.com and instantly the day after. I'm anticipating I'm now not going to lie masses, if now not thousands of bucks consistent with CTF token. This is the expectancy you want to get indexed on crypto.com and Binance because they have got a whole lot of cash this is going to flow into it. And because it's very low supply of only 120 million tokens, properly supply shop will effortlessly take place. But that is the idea. It assessments every container. So whether or not you men hate it or like it, I'm shopping for it. And the concept here is, I suggest, while you go through the list of what's a ripoff token, scam token is something that gets rut pulled. That is untrusted. That isn't always listed. And you spot quite a few of them on within the crypto area, and also you see a number of meme coins and caribou cash. But while you talk approximately application tokens, trusted tokens, verified by means of Comarch, demonstrated by Comgecko, listed via Max, indexed by means of Albank, low deliver, mass scale utility, increasing hasn't went down. The 33,000 is actually from what it released to its contemporary charge. It is not even until its all time high and it did that in nine months. So from actually where it began to 76 cents up 33. Zero, zero, zero. Whilst you look at the real rate point of the all-time they study here came about in May, so a pair of months after its launch, and I think round we'll see four or five ago, you are speaking approximately at actually surpassing over 100,000 percentage increase in nine months.